Hey ladies, today I wanna show you one of my favorite palettes. It's called the Ultimate Smoky Eye Palette. It's this cute little palette of three colors. We have a white, a black, and a gray, and each color complements each other, and I wanna show you how to use it. You ready? Okay, so we're gonna start off taking our gray color, and we are going to work doing back and forth motions in our crease area. I'm using a fluffy crease brush and we're just gonna keep taking little bits and layering it on. You could do back and forth motions or you can do little circles, very lightly touching your eye just to get the color applied. You don't want a heavy hand. A heavy hand will put like a demarcation in your eye. You want a very light hand to go back and forth with the motions. Now, if you're curious to know where your crease area is, it's halfway in between your eyebrow and your eyelashes, right in there. So once you apply the brush, you're going to feel a little indentation and that is your crease. Now I'm taking a pointier Sigma blending brush to go in with the darker color. And we're going to take that and go right into the crease again with the darker color and just doing like a half moon right into that crease area, concentrating more on the outer corner of your eye. And one thing you have to remember is less is more. Always just apply a little bit of the shadow on your brush and you can always go back in with more. Okay, so now here we have is a flat blending brush, which is another Sigma brush. And you're just gonna go over that dark color and just blending out above the top area to make sure that it looks blended instead of a dark crease line. It's all about the blending. Okay, so now I'm taking just a wide blending brush and I'm going back in with the gray and I'm gonna dust it over the top of the black that we just applied just to make sure everything blends. Think of like an airbrushing look. Perfect. Sometimes I consider my finger my best friend because I love to tap on the light color on my lids using my middle finger just to place it exactly where I want it. Okay, so we're all aging gracefully, right? So we need to make everything go in upward motion. So that's where I'm coming in with the concealer to now highlight underneath my eye. But I also use the concealer towards the outer corner of my eye to just clean up that eyeshadow and just make everything look like I got a face So now left. this is where Pharmacy's Kabuki brush comes into play because I love to use that to blend out my concealer. It's got this great flat edge. I spray it with setting spray. The time locking setting spray is amazing. You wanna wet your brush a little bit to be able to blend it out easily. And all you're doing is tapping it all over the concealer, but in an upward motion. And look at that look. You look wide-eyed, you look bright underneath your eye, and everything's going upwards. Same for the other side.
Now, whatever's left on my brush, I'm just gonna go over the tip of my nose, my forehead, my upper lip, my chin, just to give me that extra highlight. Wait for it, you ready? The finished product. Ultimate smoky eye girls, you need this palette.